Hi, I'm Seafood News Managing Editor Amanda Buckle. And I'm Erna Barry Seafood Market Reporter Lauren Castiglione. And today you're going to watch us cook. Cook? Yeah, cook. we're going to cook today. So uh, Fresh Direct, the online grocer, they serve the tri-state area. They sent us over something special that we're really excited about. Lauren, tell us what we got. We got a whole turbot. <laughs> <laughs> it's from Stolt Sea Farms, and it's actually, the timing's perfect. Lauren and I just came back from Barcelona, Spain for Seafood Expo Global, and Stolt Sea Farm, they're out of Galicia, Spain. Um, so we're very excited about this. I mean, we would prefer to go back to Spain. We would have, But yes. we'll do it in my own kitchen. <laughs> so uh, we're doing an oven-roasted turbot. Uh, Lauren, talk to us about some of our ingredients. I'm just a sous chef, so. I will first say, when we found out that we were going to be cooking a whole turbot, we both were a little apprehensive, but we figured this is our learning experience yep. together. Fresh Direct provided us with a recipe and it's super simple, super clean ingredient. Wait a minute, we need our aprons. Oh. Mm -hmm. Let's not get our, our nice okay. suits messy. So we have two teaspoons of salt ready to go. Your butter, four tablespoons, you need it softened. We have one clove of garlic minced. I did two because that's how we do. And then six sprigs of thyme with the leaves removed. And then the zest of one lemon. And the rest of the lemon you can juice and put that aside for later. Now we mash. So if you're not familiar with Stolt Sea Farms, like I said, they're out of Spain. It's sustainable aquaculture, um, land-based. They pull water directly in from the Atlantic Ocean right into their land-based aquaculture, which is really cool. So what's cool about Fresh Direct too, so Stolt Sea Farms is just one of their vendors, um, but like I said, it's an online grocer. They deliver to anywhere in the New York tri-state area. We are in that area. Um, but you can get, I mean, we, they sent us everything. Salt, lemon, thyme garlic, yep. the butter, like anything, the fresh fish. Um, so it's really cool that you have this resource that you don't even need to, to go out and go to your local grocery store. Like I said, as how many times do we say in an episode, as hardworking as young hard mothers, working it's mothers, nice to have something we to appreciate send this. directly <laughs> to your house. All right, are we ready? Yeah. So Feed me. <laughs> let's get, we need a deep roasting pan. Thanks mom for letting me borrow it. <laughs> Aren't moms the best? And we are going to put the turbot, the pale side down. If you are unfamiliar. It's a turbot, beautiful fish. It's beautiful. It has a little bit of a texture. And then on the other side, you can see the pale side. We're gonna take the mixture, the butter mixture, and we're going to spread it all over Ooh. the fish. <laughs> and the fish came um, with the fins already trimmed and cleaned, so you don't even have to do that. Mm -hmm before the butter mixture goes on, <laughs> you want to place a little incision line across the lateral line of the fish, which runs right through the middle. And so we will be doing that now. And that just helps to ensure that the cooking is nice and even. And before we put it in the oven, we'll put a few more sprigs of thyme across the top. And I like to add a little bit more lemon Yes. And that it goes beautiful. right in the oven. It does look beautiful. It's not as intimidating as I thought. I'm proud of you. So, <laughs> thank, thank you. <laughs> um, so this will go into the oven at, what are we cooking it at? 400 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. There is no overwhelming fish odor. You get mm -mm. all the lemon fresh scents. The garlic. Mm, so the we garlic. are very impressed with this so far. But I know we haven't tried it yet, but <laughs> it was as simple as literally Lauren taking that butter into her cold dead hands and, and smothering <laughs> it all over that fish. But and that's it, you put it in the oven. So I'm really excited to try this because it, it has to taste as good as it smells right now. It smells awesome. What we're first gonna do, we let the, the turbot rest for a little bit and we are going to gently pull back the skin and serve it up. So the good thing about turbot is that the bones are a little bit bigger, so you're not gonna have that pin bone issue here. And you wanna make sure you get the meat that goes all the way up to the fin too, because I hear that is the tastiest. And that comes right off. Comes right off. All right, let me get this one side filet. Comes off nice and easy. Nice large flakes, you mm -hmm. can see. Like I said, white, it definitely looks juicy. Yeah. All right, and this is both 
if we didn't already say it, our first Sorry. time. Cheers, cheers. You did a fantastic job. Thank you. It's it is a it it's is mild. A it's a little bit more firm mm -hmm. than other fish, which I kind of prefer. But very like very flaky. Yeah, and that's what I like in a in a good white fish. That's awesome. It's um. Look at us conquering our fears. Yeah, like I said, it's very. <clears throat> oh, you know what I forgot? The lemon. The lemon that we set aside. I don't even know, I mean, so, put it on it, but I don't even know if we need it. because We didn't really need it, but let's just do a little bit. Maybe it was the way you massaged that fish with all the butter. <laughs> so you want to put the, the lemon uh, juice on after you peel back the, mm. the skin so that it really gets in there. All right. Like let's, I said, I mean, we still, she cut out a small portion. You still have, like I said, this is going to feed your family. Yeah. You, have a family you get, for, what, four fillets total mm -hmm. out of it. You, you grab the other one, you flip it over, you get two more. Yeah, but it is, let's try with the butter. Uh, lemon. The lemon. Mm. Like I said, it's even fresher. You cooked it perfectly. So to celebrate Lauren's success in cooking this fish and me watching her with, with a close <laughs> eye. Cheers. Cheers to us. Follow us on Instagram. We are at watch us eat underscore seafood for more content. And behind the scenes, we have lots of that. Lots of goofball stuff. <laughs> um, and yeah, let us know what you want us to eat or cook next. If you're curious about cooking seafood, we want to be there for you. We want to show you how it's done. We want to try it for you. Let us be your guinea pigs.